Hey everybody, let's talk today about collecting Hot Wheels logo cars. That's right, any Hot Wheels car that has a Hot Wheels logo on it, a big one, and preferably on the side here. Now, when I think of Hot Wheels logo cars, I think of them starting back here with the Race Team Series back in 2000, what is this, 1997, 1997 Race Team Series. There was a bunch of them, a bunch of different Race Team Series. This one looks like Racing uh, race team series two race team series two race team series three and let's see what else race team series two race team series well this one's not even a series it's just a bug another three on that one another four race team four look at this race team series i think this might have been the first series let's see what the date is 1994 holy smokes that's a long time ago Back when they had a, just started the uh, series cars, four cars in a series like the Pearl Drivers, Dark Riders, Roaring Rod, Silver Series, Photo Finish, Racing Metals, Hot Hub, Speed Gleamer, Real Riders, Crackle Car, Steel Stamp, and Race Team back in 1994. Anyway, that's when they really got started on the big Hot Wheels logo cars. Here's another one, 1999 first edition. Not quite as groovy looking because it's got a lot of white in it most of them are mostly blue and one of my favorites the 57 chevy from the race team series 2 number three of four cars couldn't tell you what the oh wait a minute here they are ramp truck baja bug 57 chevy and byway man anyway i've got a bunch already let's open up some of these and take a look at some of the other cars that i already have in my hot wheels logo cars collection all right, let's open some of these up. I bought this last group here from like from the convention last time I was in the Los Angeles convention. A lot of these. Now, if you notice here, these two, I want to open up one of these race team trucks. They come in two different packages. Let's see if we can spot any other differences. Look at that. The number one on this one, the number one on that one are slightly different. Not for hire. Let's look at the back. Let's see. Made in da, 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 made in China. Made in Malaysia. Oh, interesting. This is one of those elusive China cars. When they made the cars in China, I think it was just for a short period of time. Now, don't quiz me on that because I don't know all those details. But I'm going to stick with this one over here. The one that was made in Malaysia. And we're going to open her up and see what she looks like. always like this truck. You can put another car on top of it. It's got nice it's look at that dark blue paint so pretty i'm gonna set it right there as we open up some more of these team cars this one is the lumina stalker dated on the back 1994 now when you're trying to figure out when a hot wheels car was made if you look at the back of the package you can come pretty close generally speaking because they can change the print on the back of a of the cardboard but they can't change the nut the base the metal on the base that has to stay with whatever date it originally had on it. Like this one, I think, is 1991 on the bottom. But that is not when it was made. It's going to be the date on the back of the card or later. And let's see, will that fit on top of there? Yes, it will. Okay, now we got the Lumina. Let's get out the Corvette's split window. Split window. Now, if you look at the bottom of split window, you see 1979. But that car was actually made in 1997, perhaps 1998 even but not the date on the base. Remember, the date on the base is the copyright, not not uh, the dis copyright of the design, not the year the Hot Wheels car was made. And that is a neat, neat looking car. Look at that Corvette split window. Put that one up on there. You'll notice that this is a dark blue. This is a little bit lighter blue. How about the Race Team Series Chevy 1500? That's a neat vehicle right there. Let's take a look at this car right now. Open her up. Whoa, I've had too much ca caffeine and chocolate this morning. The date on the bottom of this car is 1995. 1995. The date on the package is, let's see, 1996. Well, that's pretty close. This one must have been a fairly new model at the time that it came out. Look at that. Hot Wheels logo cars. How about a three-window 34 Ford? That's a beauty, and you'll see on the bottom, that says 1979, but don't think it was made then, because it was not. This particular one on the back of the package, wait a minute, look at those race sets, those look like fun. 
1996. Boy, if I had some room around here, I would set up some racetracks and race some Hot Wheels. But I tell you what, I am out of space. Not, I'm still on Earth, but I'm out of space. All right, here we go. 57 Chevy, look at this beautiful car. Holy smokes. Now, one thing that's funny about the 57 Chevy, if you look at it closely, the front end seems to slope down. It does seem to slope down. I don't know if they meant it to do that or if it just did that, but it does have quite a slope to it. There's the 57 Chevy. Probably have one of those in my collection already, but what the heck? I'm going to open these anyway. My only other choice is to put them in my antique mall for sale and let somebody else have them, but maybe later. This one says on the bottom... Hot Wheels, 1983, but you know, that's not when it was made. This one was made in 1995, or later. And this one is gorgeous. Now, they got a little carried away with the tampos up here, but the Hot Wheels looks nice. That one's got a little ding in it. That is a good looking, and I never did, never did understand why it says N-I-T-H-I-A on the side, but maybe you know. I don't really care. So, next car up. Let's see, is there any more in packages? Oh, yes, one of my favorite, the Camaro race car. Look at that beauty, the Jack Baldwin. I actually saw a Camaro with that was all decked out for Jack Baldwin when I went to Ohio for my first or second Hot Wheels convention. Anyway, look at this beauty. She is gorgeous. This is the 80s Camaro with the logos, and it is gorgeous. Let me get my box of Hot Wheels logo cars, and we'll add to this display, and it will blow your mind. Hang on. All right, everybody, are you ready to have your mind blown? Here it comes. Look at this. Dior 2 Hot Wheels logo light blue car. How about a Chevelle? Yes. Chevelle Hot Wheels logo car. Love these Hot Wheels logo cars. How about a Nova? Nova, there she is. Hot Wheels logo car. How about a Duster? Yes, Duster Hot Wheels logo car. Oops, I hit the camera there. I'm running out of space. How about this one's crazy? How about a Buick Riviera, the Boatel Riviera? Hot Wheels logo car. How about this one? I don't even know what it is. It's a 74 Torino. That's what it is. The Torino. If you ever get a chance, look at Torinos online. There's some really cool ones. How about this one? This one's kind of hard to find. This is that uh, Mustang, the big old Mustang, but it has a funny name. It's called the Boulevard Cruiser. It's a big old cool Mustang. Are there more? Yes, there are more. There is a GTO, GTO logo car. That's in my collection. How about this GTO? There's another GTO. Hot Wheels logo car. I love the Hot Wheels logo. Here's a Camaro, 70s Camaro, but this one's a really dark blue. It's the only one that I am aware of that is super dark blue, I think, except for possibly this Nova. No, nope, this is not a super dark uh, blue. This is just another Nova. And, oh my goodness, what about this one, the Bone Shaker with the Hot Wheels logo. Yes, how about the Maverick? Maverick Hot Wheels logo car. Get out there and search for these Hot Wheels logo cars on eBay or whatever. Maybe you can get a bunch of them at one time. How about the pickup truck with the Hot Wheels logo? And this is not the new one. This is one from a couple of years ago, a few years ago. Not sure exactly. And did you know that that 57 Chevy was redone a second time in a Hot Wheels logo car, but it's different. It's newer than the first one, but looks very similar. Got a little more decoration on it. Not quite as well made, but it is 57 Chevy Hot Wheels logo car. And in case you weren't aware of it, they did attempt to make some other colors at one time. Black. I've got five different black ones in the Hot Wheels logo. And only one in the red. This Corvette in the red with the big Hot Wheels logo. I'm sure there's more Hot Wheels logo cars, so get out there and look for them. This is what I've got. Thanks for joining me to, for a look at Hot Wheels logo cars. Yay! Whoa, one more thing before I completely sign off of this video. I was just putting the cars away and found this. This is a Hot Wheels logo car in black, not blue. It's in black, but it's also in satin black, and it is the only one that I have. Now, are there more satin black logo cars out there? I don't know. Get out there and find some and let me know in the comments below. Thanks for joining me. Bye now.